the couple have chosen FA Cup final day to walk down the aisle at Windsor. Wedding could clash with coverage of UK's biggest football match of the year. Harry and Meghan break protocol by choosing Saturday so public can see it. But May 19 confirms that there will be no extra bank holiday for British workers. Conflict as Prince William will be Harry's best man but is also president of the FA. The suit star, 36, will be baptized and confirmed by coffee before May ceremony. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will marry on May 19 at Windsor Castle's famous St George's Chapel, it was today. The couple have chosen to ignore royal tradition and walk down the aisle on a Saturday so more people in the UK and across the globe can watch on TV or even come to Berkshire on their wedding day. A royal aide told Mail Online today, they remain hugely grateful for the messages of support they have received from people all over the world. But football fans are bemused because they will wait on FA Cup final day even though Harry's best man Prince William is FA president and usually presents its famous trophy to the winners at Wembley. It could also lead to a TV coverage clash of the first major royal wedding since 2011 and the biggest football match of the year in Britain. The date also means Harry and his fiancée will not to marry on either the early May or late May bank holidays as wished for by some working Britons. And May 19th ensures that the wedding will not overshadow the birth of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's third child in April and allow Kate the time to recover. Scroll down for video Harry and Meghan's wedding, what we know so far. Date May 19, 2018 Venue, St. George's Chapel, Windsor Who will marry them? Archbishop of Canterbury is said to have agreed. Best man, Prince William is the strong favourite. Bridesmaids, Meghan hasn't the list but it could include Star Wars actress Janina Gavankar, ex-maid in Chelsea star Millie McIntosh, tennis champion Serena Williams, fashion designer Mishinanu and former Miss World Priyanka Chopra. The Duchess of Cambridge is a less likely choice. What will it cost? At William and Kate's wedding planners put the cost of a cake or cakes to feed guests at up to £50,000 or as little as £10,000 for a modest version. There are rumours they may choose a banana cake. The Duchess of Cambridge's dress was said to have cost up to £250,000 while flowers for Westminster Abbey and Buckingham Palace were said to have been between £200,000 to £500,000. Who will foot the bill? The Queen has said she and the rest of the royal family will pay for the traditional wedding costs like the ceremony, flowers, music and the reception, but security is likely to be paid for by the taxpayer. Security at Prince William and Kate's wedding was as much as £20 million, which dwarfed the £7.4 million price of security at the G20 protests in London in 2009. As a more direct comparison, the 1981 wedding between Prince Charles and Diana Spencer was estimated to have cost £4 million, which equates to around £12 million today. Royal sources insisted last night the events would not overlap, which suggests the wedding could take place in the morning, with a cup final in the late afternoon. A royal aide said the couple opted for a weekend wedding because they wanted as many members of the public to be involved as possible, whether by watching it on television or attending in person at Windsor. The Mail understands Harry and Meghan were keen to avoid the possibility of having to declare a bank holiday and wanted the wedding to seem more informal. Most couples get married on a Saturday and it wasn't as if they had to worry about another couple already having snagged the date, said a source. Last night the male the Archbishop of Canterbury will marry Prince Harry and divorcee Meghan, in another sign of changing royal and religious mores. In Iradian, 